New to 9 at 11, a UC Davis alumna is getting ready to take flight in just a couple of months. And this isn't just any flight. We're talking about space. Tracy Dyson will head to the International Space Station. We spoke with her about what she'll do on this upcoming mission and her history among the stars. Take a listen. Space, a vast expanse just beyond our atmosphere, but only few get to explore this wonder. And Tracy Dyson is one of them. The Californian native is getting ready for launch. We are headed for the International Space Station, where I will be spending six months as a crew member on board. She and two others will travel to the ISS from Kazakhstan in March. Dyson will serve as a flight engineer. She shared with us what she'll be doing up above spacewalks, robotics, visiting vehicles, and of course, science. And this isn't her first mission. Dyson has already made two space flights, one in 2007 aboard the space shuttle Endeavour, and a second in 2010. I don't know if it's the view looking out away from our planet or the view looking at our planet that is more striking. And having been on the space station and seeing our Earth from that vantage point, um, I'm one of those that could stare back at our planet for, you know, hours on end. And Dyson has local roots. She went to UC Davis for grad school, where she earned a PhD in chemistry in 1997, spending a lot of time in the lab doing research. Some of my fondest memories of being at UC Davis was just all the, it sounds maybe corny to say the discovery, but really there was a lot of discovery that I made that I really enjoyed what I was doing. In total, Dyson has logged more than 180 days in space. To actually be there is, um, uh, I think, intriguing to a lot of people, young or old, and to just ask what, what's really out there. An incredible journey ahead, and Dyson is expected to return home from her six-month trip in September.